All right, in this one, we're going to be talking about all of the elements that you need to get going in live streaming. Be seen, heard, and better understood through virtual gatherings. Elevate your message with Corporate Streams. Hi, everybody. My name is Noah. I am the founder of Corporate Streams, and I've been working with Fortune 100 companies for over six years doing corporate communications. I've also worked in the media business on large TV shows and films, and I'm excited to show you a few things that I've picked up along the way. So there is a huge range of content that is being created out there that can leverage live streaming, like gaming, wedding, product demonstrations, town hall meetings, corporate communications, annual events, and this just scratches the surface. So in this series, we're gonna be focusing on live streaming as a whole and how that applies to business communication. Here is what a 10,000 foot view of a live stream might look like for you. So let's start from the top here. Your talent or the show is the program or content that you're planning for your audience to see. Your show will be captured by one or multiple cameras and this data will go through a video switcher which combines or mixes those images into a single feed in real time. The output of the switcher, which is referred to as the program, goes into the encoder or capture device and is translated into something the computer can understand. Streaming software like OBS can do some of the same functions as a switcher, like cut between multiple cameras and add graphics, but it also can output your program to a streaming platform like Facebook, YouTube, or a company website. Let's not forget the support gear like lighting and audio, which help your team better be seen and heard. All of these elements are part of the whole picture for live streaming. I know there's gonna be a lot to cover here, so let's just talk about a summary of each one of the topics that we'll be covering in this free training series. Workflow, which is understanding the start to finish of how your video and audio travels through your production. Staging and sets. These are the backdrops and the elements that help make up the look and feel of your show. Audio, which will include cables, connectors, microphones, sound isolation, a PA system, capture devices, recorders, and mixers. Lighting, the instruments to brighten your subject. Tripods, the fundamental building block that supports your camera. Cameras, which are f-stops, ISO, gain, shutter speed, frame rate, white balance, lenses, lens mounts, ND filters, power, interfaces like outputs, record media, aspect ratios, resolutions, sensors, bit depth, codecs, and compression. Teleprompters, which are traditionally used for scripts, but also can be used for live video, PowerPoint, and other playback elements. Graphics, like lower thirds, titles, and overlays to help tell your story. Video switchers, which are the tools that are used to help intermix multiple cameras and sources to enhance your program. The multicam director, which is the person who brings all of the elements together. Encoders, which are the hardware devices that turn digital video into something your computer can understand. Streaming software, which is the software that allows you to output your video to the platform of choice. A backup recorder, which stores a copy of the program or cameras for later use. The network, which connects devices together and to the internet for worldwide connectivity. Platforms, which are the destinations like Facebook, YouTube, or a company website to host the live video. And finally, we'll be talking about the future of live streaming with augmented reality, virtual reality, and other technologies like 3D. We're just scratching the surface of all these topics, so make sure to save this playlist as we take a deep dive into each one of these topics. And here's a great bonus tip for live streaming. Like most things in life, if you plan ahead, you'll plan for success. So make sure to give yourself ample time to set up your gear, hire the crew you need, and think through each one of the points that we've outlined in this series. Having a script or at least bullet points will help free them up from the stress and anxiety of missing vital information during their presentations. If you want to find out how you can maximize your live streaming potential, you can always contact us at Corporate Streams. Let me know what experiences you have with live streaming in the comments below. We'd love to hear from you. And we'll see you in the next video about workflows.